Hey, what's up guys? This is Ali from isocialu.com and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, we're gonna talk about Facebook Messenger ads. How can you use Facebook Messenger ads to generate leads for your business? Now, before we jump into this video, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that bell icon. Now, in this video, I'm gonna show you a real Facebook campaign, a Messenger ad campaign that we have running for one of our clients and then I will walk you through the step-by-step -step process that you can use to create Facebook Messenger ads for your own business. All right, let's jump into this. So here I am logged into the ads manager and here's the campaign that I wanna focus on, the Messenger. And let's actually, let me show you some data first of all. So I'm gonna select last 30 days. So as you can see, this campaign, the results we have eight messages and then we're paying $18.75 per message. Now, I know some of you are gonna say that's a lot, but keep in mind the value of lead for this business is actually $50 or more. And let me actually give you the background on this business. So basically, it's a tutoring business. We're targeting moms and asking them to book a session, a tutoring session for their kids. Now, every session costs more than $50. And guess what? Once we have a new person come in, a new lead that comes in, they book this session multiple times. So the lifetime value of a new customer for us is much higher than $18. So it's very, very profitable and very good campaign for us. All right, now let me show you how this campaign is set up before we jump into the step-by-step -step process. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hit that edit. I wanna show you exactly how we have set up this campaign. And again, you know, if you have watched my other videos on Facebook ads, I always talk about three-step process. So step one is the campaign, then step two is the ad set, and then step number three is the actual ad. So first of all, let's look at the campaign. It's very simple, this is the name. You can name your campaign anything. Um, here's the key thing, the objective is set up to messages. That's what you wanna make sure you, set, you select that. And I'll show you this, how to do this in a second. And now let's look at the ad set. So this is extremely important. You wanna select the, the target audience that's most likely to convert or most likely to become leads for your business. And if you wanna learn more about how I set the targeting for Facebook ads, leave a comment below. Let me know if you are interested in talking about selecting the target audience for different businesses, how do you do research and different types of target audiences, and I will, will be more than happy to create some videos. All right, so for this, the ad set name, again, you can name anything that you like, the daily budget, $5 per day. So here's the other lesson. A lot of people say the Facebook ads need to be a really big, cash drain on your business, that's not true. Depending on your strategy and what you're doing, what your process is, what your funnel is, you can actually use Facebook ads with very, very, very small budgets like $5 per day. All right, let's scroll down. And here is, so the target audience for this business, for this campaign is moms in Dallas, Texas and 50 mile radius. So we have the city selected because that's the, the area this business operates in. And we have selected the age range, 25 to 65 women. Obviously, we were, our goal is to target moms. And now this is the key. Look at the, the terms that we have selected. So we're targeting moms and with that, the terms, the demographic that we have selected is parents of early school kids, preschoolers, parents with preteens, and then people or women who are interested in childcare or parenting. So guess what? If you are a woman, 25 to 65, and have shown interest in this, and also live in Dallas, Texas, we wanna show you our ad campaign. So again, super important to select the right type of targeting audience for your business. All right, let's scroll down from placement. So here's the other thing. Guess what? 
since we are running the messenger ad campaign so we have only selected the Facebook newsfeed Instagram newsfeed and then the messenger inbox and we have disabled the stories and other places and then the optimization is set to replies because we want people to send us a message all right so step number one was the campaign you saw the setup step number two the ad set the key thing there is the targeting that you set and now let's look at the step number three which is the actual ad so first of all make sure you have your page set up and then when you scroll down here is the actual ad so look how simple we're showing the the kids in the picture and then a simple call to action find a tutor in 24 hours very very simple but we are speaking directly to our target audience if you are a mom in Dallas Texas have kids and you're looking for a tutor this ad is speaking directly to you that's the key and then obviously we have selected the send message call to action all right now let me show you how this ads looks like in the news feed so let's resize this so I'm gonna go here and then click on Facebook post with comments and here you go so simple copy attention busy moms you know we're speaking directly to our moms we can be your hero save you from homework tears 24 hours or less will match you with the tutor and help you get set up with your first session simple learn more or DMS direct message us right and then they can click on send message and look at this so tons of engagement comment shares from this ad campaign so that tells me we are targeting the right people and also there are a lot of people who were sending us message and just inquiring about our tutoring service super super awesome all right now the other thing I want to show you so you we saw how the this campaign is set up we saw how the ad looks like on the Facebook newsfeed now I'm gonna go to that page and then go to the inbox and here are bunch of messages so for example this person came I'm interested can you tell us more and she came directly from our ad here is the other person she also came from our ad campaign here is another person so our messenger ad campaign is actually getting us messages for sure here is another one here is another one super simple and super awesome all right so this was the breakdown of actual campaign that we are running for this client we're using the Facebook messenger ad objective Facebook messenger ad campaigns to generate leads for their business now let me walk you through the process of how do you want to create this campaign from scratch all right let's jump into this the first thing you want to do is click on that create button right here and now again three-step process campaign ad set and then the ad for campaign our objective is gonna be let me resize this so make sure you select the messenger messages that objective so right here and I'm just gonna say test campaign you can name it whatever you want not gonna do the split test or campaign budget optimization for now hit continue and again the ad set part and this is where you can select the the des destination Again, you can name this whatever you want so I'm just gonna say DFW moms 50 mile radius for destination we're gonna select the click to the messenger and then for the audience so this is the most important part of your ad set so make sure you select the right parameters for your audience again I'm gonna select women and let's do actually 26 
detail targeting so I'm gonna say parents I can do parents all and you'll see there's a lot of other options preschool and there might be option for K to 12 and there might be option for tutoring there you go so our potential reach is 710,000 people that's really good and then the added placement a lot of people would start with the automatic placement you can but you can also I like to edit and then really eliminate I want this on my Facebook news feed and the messenger inbox and I don't want this on any other placement you can definitely right now in 2019 story ads are super super cheap so if you want you can test those but let's go with the placement of inbox and the Facebook news feed for now and then I want to optimize for replies and then uh, based on whatever your daily budget is uh, you set that here and this sometimes Facebook will give you different warning messages for example let's say if you're using a image and that has a lot of text they're gonna show you an error message or a warning message saying uh, you may get less reach so it doesn't mean that your ad will not run you just have to test it and I believe here if I raise my budget to let's say hundred dollar per day obviously that's a lot sometimes that message will the error message or the warning message will go away anyways for now I'm just gonna go with five dollars and then hit continue and now this is where you want to create your actual ad so make sure you have your Facebook page the right page selected if you're running this on Instagram you can also add the Instagram account I'm not gonna do that right now and then for the format you can do a carousel ad or a single image or video let's do the single image or video and by the way actually you can create the ad from scratch or you can also use one of the existing posts from your page so if you already have a post an organic post that you have put on your page you can use that as a ad creative for this campaign so for example um, you would select the use existing post and then hit select post and then here are different Facebook posts that we have so you can select one of these so for example let's say if you want to do this actually there's an error message that's already running so let's see if we can do this yes we can I'm gonna hit continue yeah let's go with that so it looks like a, a tutor and a kid so that's a good image and then the call to action button is gonna be send messages and let's update the post And then this is where so your creative part is done and by the way I ended up using the existing post if you want to create a new ad you can also upload your media which means your image if you want to use a video you can do that as well and then add your headline and then the primary text right here for now let's go back to the existing post ooh so sometimes Facebook Ads Manager is glitchy and shows these crazy warning messages <laughs> that went away so that's good alright let's scroll down so this is where you can use or create your messenger setup so what do you want people to see so for example if you want to create a new here is you know the sequence that people will see you can edit this and then create your questions for example is anyone available to chat so these are the options people will see when someone clicks on your ad campaign and they see they go to your the messaging window here are different options so what do you want them to select so is anyone available to chat I'm interested can you tell me more 
can I learn more about your business, something like that. So for example, in this case, I can say, hey, I need a tutor. There you go, please help. So you can really customize the messaging basically. Let's hit save and finish. And then make sure you have your pixel selected. All right, so once you are done and happy with all the settings, just hit the confirm button right here and this will go to Facebook for the approval process. All right, super simple, but also very, very powerful. If you are not using Facebook Messenger ad campaigns for your business, I would strongly encourage to you to at least test these. And like you saw in this video, you don't have to spend a lot of money. You don't have to spend $100, $200. You can test with $5, $10. If you have the budget, maybe even $20 campaign and then see what type of results you get from these campaigns. Now, again, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so you get notifications when I launch my future videos. Thanks again for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.